Welcome to Mr. Peacock and Friends. I wonder what Mr. Peacock will be doing today. Let's find out, but first you have to find him. Have you seen Mr. Peacock? Mr. Peacock! Mr. Peacock! I'm here. Oh, there you are, Mr. Peacock. We're all wondering what you're going to be doing today. Today, I'm going to show you a very old town. A very old town? Yeah, and it had something very important happen to it, and later on, moved. <laughs> Shall we go see a very old town that got moved? Let's go see it, Mrs. Peacock. Okay. I'm ready to see it. Come on, everybody. Let's go. We're in Old Town, Macedonia, Iowa, and Mrs. Peacock's going to tell us why they call it Old Town, Macedonia, Iowa. Well, this is Old Town, Macedonia, Iowa, because this is where Macedonia used to be. But then there was a flood, so they moved to higher ground and moved the town. It is so interesting to go check out all these small communities around the USA, and we found this little town. I've known about this town for many, many years, but not the old town. And they have a commemorative rock here to show everybody, and it's a historical marker. So when you're going into town to check out their cool fence and museums, you gotta check this out. That's right, this is a 10,000 pound red granite boulder, and it commemorates Old Macedonia where the Mormons approached the West Nishnabotna River crossing on June 12, 1846. And that's the rest of the story about Old Macedonia, Iowa. What you find? Well, there's a sign here, and it talks about Old Macedonia, of course, and it says that the Mormon Pioneer Party built a bridge across the West Nishnabotna River near here and crossed the river on June 11, 1846. The settlers had come from Illinois and they created a town named Macedonia. So then they led a Macedonia wagon train west. So 42 others arrived here in February 1847 and established Macedonia Camp, which on May 11th became the Macedonia branch of the LDS Church, which is 140 members. The Mormons left here in June 1852. Macedonia then became a non-LDS hamlet and gained a post office, a school, and a half a dozen shops. This place became known as Old Town after present-day Macedonia grew up a mile east of here on a new 1880 railroad line. If you like our videos, please subscribe, like, and share with all your friends.